All right, this is a quick video on how to disassemble one of these Dornbracht air switches. So basically you want to pull it out of your countertop just by loosening that plastic nut on the bottom. When you flip it over, it's going to be a rubber ring around here. You just want to remove it. And then you want to get a tool into these two holes and twist that whole ring to pull that whole thing apart. So we're going to do that now with a pair of Allen wrenches. It's not particularly easy, but it works. Ah, we'll be back with you in a minute. All right, so just take a little bit of soaking in vinegar, but you can keep turning this. So basically soaked it for about 20 minutes in the water and vinegar mixture, freed it up, and then uh, we're able to turn it. So basically you want to just keep unscrewing it until it comes all the way off. Take this piece off. Now you can just pull that out. And here's your button. And there's all the debris things. This can just be pulled out like that and you get all the junk inside. And this inner plunger you can just pull out with the pliers. And all that's left in there is the rubber button, which typically doesn't need to be cleaned off at all. Just need to get the water out of that. So now we're just going to throw this into a uh, vinegar or water bath. This one actually is not that much hard water on it, just some debris. But uh, And that's it. And just reassemble it and it uh, rinse everything off and it should be back to normal. Finally, we use just some uh, O-ring silicone lubricant on the O-ring inside that chamber. And uh, move the piston up and down a couple times. And the whole thing is fixed and the button comes flush to, back flush to the, uh, like it's supposed to.